Jamie, it's a, a defeat here at Fleet this afternoon. Batting performance, but it's tough to take, isn't it? It is, yeah. Um, it's disappointing. So we've done our research on them, how they'd want to play, and we've implemented that. We wanted, to sh we showed how we wanted to play, and it just didn't really execute it well enough. I think we had the better chances in the game, um, but it just comes down to both boxes, and we wasn't ruthless enough, really. I know you started off on the bench, but watching on going going behind uh, at that time is, is obviously bad time, and it's, it's quite close to half time, and. It's, it's frustrating to take, isn't it? It is. It is. Actually, we had our ch we did we had we did have chances as well. I don't think there was much in it really. It wasn't it wasn't a great game to watch, um, but yeah, the goals changed games and yeah, we were our own downfall really for that first one. Half time almost came a little bit too soon for us. We, we were on top towards the end of the uh, break. What was the message from the gaffer in, in the in the dressing room? Well, he uh, he just wanted us to show a bit be a bit more ballsy really because we've. Uh, I've only just come in, but we are used to winning games. This, this side, it's a win, there's, there's a winning mentality here, and I think it's come off the boil a little bit last, I'm guessing the last month. Um, so we just wanted to get back to where we were and a reaction. Um, obviously, the goal, the free kicks. Up, there's not much you can do about that, really. But then it would, like I said, over the, over the course of the game, I think we did have the best chances. But we got to use this now to really kick on because we're in a great position and we just need to be like catch us if you can. We don't want to do it for, let other teams catch us for our own poor performances. As you said, the gaffer asked for a reaction in the second half. It, it came to, a, to an extent. We had chances, Josh Coroma went close, so did Jordan Maguire drew. We looked like the only team capable of scoring in that second half, didn't we? We did, we did. I think we looked the fitter team towards the end, but like I said, when you're 2-0 down, it's easy to you show a bit more. We need to be doing that from the get-go. Congratulations on your debut. I know it's tough to take in tough circumstances to make it in, but how did it feel going out there in front of quite a large Orient following? Yeah, so the, f the fans are brilliant. Um, I've, like I said, it's, as a centre back to come on, there's not really a like you make sure I can nearly scored with the first touch really, and I was, a, like I said, a nuisance in their box. But really, it's not about that. It, it's good to be a part, but I just want to get us back to winning games of football. As you said, you were a nuisance in their box. You came on and, and hit the post. Matt Harold came on and put himself about. So did Craig Clay. It's good to have that uh, kind of strength off the bench, isn't it? That's it, yeah. It's good that the gaffer could turn around and be like, these players are going to come in and change the game. Like, so we've got a really good squad here and we, there's a togetherness. So we really, like I said, we're determined to put things right and get back on this winning run. And just finally, we're still top of the league. It might be by goal difference, but, but we're still top. We've got to make sure that we uh, stay there in the games to come, don't we? That's it. We need to we need to get back to how we have this side worked in the first half of the season. We need to carry that on and more. And hopefully it should be enough.